We loved him as Peter Parker's best friend, Ned, in the Spider-Man movies. Now, Jacob Batalone is starring in the new show, Reginald the Vampire. So happy to meet you. Thank you so much. And I love <laughs> the concept of Reginald the Vampire. You're sort of, a, it's a fish out of water story, absolutely. if you will, as, yeah. as, a, as poor Reginald navigates <laughs> the world of vampires. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, he is very much thrusted into this place where no one really expects him to be. Um, you know, he kind of goes through life sort of accepting his sort of societal role as, as not the hero. And so we really get to watch him grow into that part. It's really fun. You're an accidental vampire, if you will. This Absolutely. is not something you chose or were born into. Absolutely um, You need to see it. <laughs> it. And you described the show, because in, in, I said, well, should I call it a dark comedy? Yeah. And you said it's very... It's very zany, for sure. It is. Um, it, it's, there's a lot of comedies, a lot of dark turns in it, but we absolutely change it up with the comedy immediately afterwards. So I want to uh, set this up. You guys, we have a clip here for everybody from tonight's season finale. Yeah. And um, this is where Reginald has to take an ability assessment test. Yes. All right, let's take a look. <laughs> catch the orb. You must catch the orb before it hits the ground. I figured that out all by myself. Thank you very much. You're welcome. On my mark. Three, two, one. Oh, wrong shoes. Fail. Uh, wow, <clears throat> Reginald. <laughs> yeah, well, oh, Reginald. <laughs> yeah, so Jacob, let me ask you, from yeah. Spider-Man's sidekick to lead yeah. and executive producer of this show, yeah. what drew you to the character of Reginald? Was it just a ton of fun to play? It was very fun, and, and you know, I guess for me growing up, I absolutely re related to a lot of the tropes that we, we sort of uh, poke fun at. You know, I think growing up as, as a fatter person, I, I feel like I was always, I always felt as if, like, I never really had a chance to really be anybody special. And, you know, with, like, society telling me that I need to look a certain way and be a certain way to be successful and win in life, it really put me down a lot of the time. And so I feel like for Reginald, he sort of represents us all in that we have, we all have insecurities that we don't need to let us uh, hold, hold us back. So, um... Yeah, I think a lot of those sort of things. Really yeah, you drew don't you me. don't fit the mold in in your yeah. vampire world yeah. of what you know. I was reading some of the research and yeah. you know the really beautiful vampires yeah. and, and the sort of metaphors that we yeah. hold to society for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. What's the best part of playing this character? Oh gosh, you know, I, I think the best part is honestly just trying to be human while being vampire. You know, it's it's really ironic that he learns a lot about life through death. So, um, yeah, it's a really crazy human journey that I get to be a part yeah, of. Yeah, your character really comes into his own as a man. Unfortunately, he's now yeah, in, dead. In the a undead. Dead man. Yeah. yeah, and 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 it's all fun and games, but there are some bad vampires who, Absolutely. who want to make you even more dead. Yes, because I don't really fit the mold, the bosses of the, of the vampire society don't really deem me as like acceptable, so here we are at the assessment. <laughs> yes. Um, so back to Spider-Man. Um, yeah. it, it's been a, a minute, five years, I think, since you yeah. did the first one. Yeah. What was that experience like working with Tom Holland, who I know is your friend? Yeah, I mean, it's, it was amazing. You know, I think we were all very young when we started out. You know, and uh, to really look back and to see where we're at now has been a truly amazing journey. Um, I, I think that I did not expect my life to go this way. Um, I was just really lucky to have a job. So, um, you know, now, now, now that I'm here on Good Morning America by myself, it's interesting. It's, yeah. it's definitely a crazy, crazy experience. Well, you've earned it. You've <laughs> earned it. You the so show much. is great. It's really, really nice to I meet you. I appreciate it. Continued success. Thank you so much. And everybody, please do check out the season finale of Reginald the Vampire. It's zany. Uh, it's airing tonight on Sci Fi. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.